It's hard not to see when the things are Hello out there, and get ready for some NBA basketball on 2K Sports. I'm Brian Anderson, joined by Hall of Famers Doris Burke and Grant Hill, and the fourth member of our crew, reporter Ali LaForce. We've got the Boston Celtics taking on the San Antonio Spurs. Looking at the starting five for the Boston Celtics. White and Brown are the two and the three. Jason Tatum out there with Kristaps Porzingis. And it's Holiday in at the one. Now here's Parker. Using his post moves to get the two points. And so Holiday will bring it up for the Boston Celtics. Pass to Brown. Porzingis sets a screen. And Brown gets the three. Jalen Brown has tightened his handle, and that allows him to be effective as a pick and roll option. Parker passes to Green. Back to Parker. And stolen by Holiday. Here's White. Rips down the breakaway slam. Adding insult to injury with the dunk off the steal. Nice to see a good play on D. That led to some fireworks. Uh, let's see if that serves as a momentum builder. What a great sequence for this group. So it's San Antonio now. After the basket by Boston. Here's Parker. The bank shot, no good. And the shooter had very little space on that attempt. Right, he stays connected and great timing on the contest. Well, terrific defense. They obviously respect his ability and just want to make it tough. Leonard outside. Back to Parker. Six on the shot clock. Leonard outside. Let's it go from deep. He drops it from range. And Kawhi, if you look at the numbers, is a consistent three-point threat. And this guy is capable in the clutch. Contest those opportunities. About two minutes gone by in the first quarter. Tatum looking it over. Pass to White. Outside Tatum. Outside Porzingis. Offline with a three. Leonard passes to Green. Here's Duncan. Pounded by Tatum. Here's Splitter. Parker outside. Spurs need to get one up here. And stolen by Porzingis. Pass to Tatum. And that one goes in as he's fouled. It'll be three points if he converts the free throw. At the line for the Celtics, Jason Tatum. One shot. And misses. From the moment Jason Tatum stepped into this league, he has been a guy who has wanted the burden offensively, and he has delivered. Green, the pass to Parker. Parker, Parker, Parker. To the inside. Lays it up and banks it in. Parker's gotten his second bucket of the game. And setting the tempo with an assertive move. Like, where was the defense on that play? To me, that's a complete lack of communication on that side of the ball. These guys need to be talking to each other. Here's Tatum following the bucket by the Spurs. From outside, off the mark. Parker passes to Green. Back to Parker. Here's Splitter, defended by Porzingis. Here's Parker. That one's good. This game is all even. Parker's got six. 
Making a statement here early, going right to the rack. Oh, I love it. And this is why you get the ball into his hands. Let him establish the pace and rhythm of the game. Porzingis, outside Tatum. The three ball. And that makes him three for four. He's looking good. Boy, that jumper is as pure as it gets. Jason Tatum off a pass from his teammate, makes easy work of it. Parker outside. Shoots from 12. Boston with a rebound. And here's Tatum. Seven points in the game. Poke loose. And stolen by Leonard. Parker against Holiday. Now here's Parker. Tightly guarded. Shot clock at six. Pass to Splitter. Porzingis grabs the board. The Celtics with the lead. Outside Tatum. Takes a three. No. He's made three. Missed two now. And so it's Leonard who brings up the ball for San Antonio. Outside. Green. Pass to Duncan. And here's Parker. Fires the three. It's hauled in by White. To the paint. Here's Porzingis. He's off on the layup. Well, we didn't see the same kind of control we're used to seeing from him. This guy is usually a tremendous finisher. Back to Leonard. Here's Duncan. Defended by Brown. Green for three. And once again, off the mark by San Antonio. Left side, Brown. Pass to Tatum. A deep three. Rebounded by the Spurs. Parker with it. Outside, Green. Pass to Splitter. Parker outside. He nails it, and we're tied. Parker's got nine. <laughs> Even against tight defense, he is so good from out there. Timeout called, the Celtics. It's now an opportunity to take a break and talk about their strategy moving forward. Well, there's something that the coach doesn't like. I'm curious to see which kind of adjustment he makes here. by Leonard. Oh, 
to the inside. Parker passes to Duncan. That puts him in the lead. Attacking in the painted area. Clearly that was their game plan coming in. Leonard against Brown. Puts up a three. Sinks it from distance. Brown's got his second basket of the night. That three-point shooting sets up every aspect of Jalen Brown's game. What a pretty shot. Parker passes to Green. Here's Splitter, defended by Porzingis. And the call will be against Derek White. That's his first foul. Al Horford's checked in for Boston. against Holiday. They set the pick. Six on the shot clock. It's Parker on the attack. And it goes. As the official calls the foul, count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. All right, guys, what do you think about the offensive approach we've seen so far for the Spurs? They've been really going at the defense in the painted area, and so far the opposition really hasn't had an answer for them. Yeah, and in addition, their ball movement has really unleashed their offense. Boy, they've been fun to watch. And so it's Brown with it. He brings it up for the Celtics. Trailing by two. Oh, and a dunk by Brown! We've got to get this guy in the dunk contest. Jalen Brown taking flight with that insane athleticism. Brown's got three of his four shots to fall, hitting 75%. Parker with it. Porzingis picks him up defensively. Parker, no good. Now here's White. It's Brown on the wing. The shake. His fourth make in five tries. Solid start for him. Well, that's where you use your athleticism and agility if you're Jalen Brown navigating to a high percentage look. Brown's gone four of five shooting from the field. Green, the pass to Parker. Here's Splitter. Back to Parker. And he floats it in for the easy two. Credit the sweet setup on that one. Good execution. They're getting some short-range looks here. Parker's gotten six of his ten shots to go. It's Brown on the wing. Pass to Porzingis. And a slam dunk by Porzingis. Uh, just fundamental basketball from Chris Stapp's Porzingis. Establish yourself inside and finish with the jam. San Antonio trailing here. Here's Diaw. Here's Splitter. He's scoreless. And there's the call on Al Horford. That's his first foul of the game. And some changes here for the Celtics. Tillman's checked in for Porzingis. Hauser comes in for White. And Pritchard is subbed in for Drew Holiday. Parker left side. Cool pops the J after a cagey pass fake. Parker's got 16 points now. <laughs> this night already has the makings of an offensive war. Well, the fans love it. Coaches may not like the lack of defense, but boy, the rules promote scoring, no doubt. Gotta fight harder to get over those screens. You know, we see this all the time. You're basically, as a defender, hoping the man misses rather than putting in the work to get over screens. On offense, here is San Antonio. Trailing by two. The floater. That shot's good by Parker. He's got 18. 
I'll tell you, a terrific read from Corey Joseph. He recognizes the overcommitment of the defense and takes advantage. And Boston has possession. Brown looking around. Fires the three. And again, Boston with the triple. And his fantastic performance from the last game has carried over to tonight. Now, I think that's the one thing every player is searching for, consistency. They're giving this guy a chance to carry the offense once again. Well, known for being a terrific passer, he shows you right there. Case in point. 149 left in the first quarter of the game. Brown inside. Count it. Good. And the Celtics lead by three. That's the physique of Jalen Brown. This guy is strong. He can absorb contact and still finish. San Antonio with the ball. Pass to Joseph. Here's Ginobili. No made baskets yet. Here's Bonner. The three is up. And it's Tillman with a rebound. And the defense got away with one there. I mean, that's the shot he typically makes. Outside, Brown. Oh, and he got fouled on his way up. He'll head to the line to shoot two. How about the uptake from Jalen Brown? This guy's so convincing with it. And a moment now to quickly take a look at the offensive approach for Boston. Yeah, their early focus on outside scoring has paid off. They're finding plenty of points from three-point land. The other thing they're doing is making plays off the bounce. And boy, once they get a step, they're getting all the way. Free throw good. Brown. What I love about Jalen Brown is his commitment to improvement. This guy's worked hard on his three-point shooting. He's worked hard on his handle and his decision-making, and there's still another level to come. Tatum, he's checked in for Boston. He makes one or two that time. Here's Ginobili, hounded by Tatum. Outside, Williams. Pass to Ginobili. Here's the three, and the three-pointer goes. Listen, this guy is not the most dangerous threat from there, but you have got to honor the shooting a little bit. Outside Tatum. Now here's Horford. And here's Brown. Yes, great play by Horford to set him up. Brown's got 20. Well, this is where the powerful frame and explosive athleticism of Jalen Brown becomes a problem for the opponent. Nicely done. Shot clock and game clock separated by less than six seconds. Outside, Williams. Picked his pocket. Here we go, one on one. Here's Pritchard. Williams defending. Horford outside. Shot on the wing, and it's Tatum missing. And for him, that's a great look. Expect him to go right back to it if it's available. Uh, no doubt. Very good play call, good execution. Sometimes it just doesn't fall. And at the end of one, a closely contested game so far. Celtics out in front. They lead by three. And we'll be back shortly for the start of the second quarter. If you're just joining us, it's been a pretty even game through the first quarter. And for the Celtics here, guys, what jumps out to you stat-wise? It's all about the strong inside-out game in the first period. It really helped them get some clean looks down low. It is great when you can get that established early because, to me, it opens up every other aspect of your game. We've got Corey Joseph. He's out there with Patrick Mills. And it's Ginobili in at the three. That's the San Antonio five. 
Mills with it. Now Horford defending. Mills, the pass to Joseph. Five on the clock. A little mid-range shot is up. Yes, on the jumper. Joseph has gotten his first points in this one. Uh, you just need to have a high level of basketball IQ in the pick and roll. Corey Joseph, step to the mic, sir. Pass to Brown. To the middle. Here's Pritchard. The shot no good. Ooh, excellent D there from Mills. Let's the three fly. Offensive rebound. Here's Duncan. And he takes that one up and powers it through. Already five lead changes here. Speaks to how evenly matched these teams have been thus far. And we played through the first minute here in the second. Here's Pritchard. Yet to see a basket. Pass to Tillman. And he lobs it up top. Oh, Tatum slams it home. Wow, how about the long arms and the timing of Jason Tatum on the alley-oop. Nice. Now Mills. Here's Joseph. Shoots over Brown. Joseph can't hit. The Celtics with the lead. Here's Pritchard. Oh, it's stolen. Back come the Spurs in transition. Mills, the pass to Joseph, and he gets it to go. Well, Patty Mills has proven to be a very capable scorer, but he can also be an outstanding passer. Joseph has gone two of three from the floor. A chance here to catch up with Alley from the sideline. Well, Jalen Brown has shown steady development over his career. He said, quote, every year presents different challenges. I think that's the fun part about basketball, that it's not the same. you got to be flexible, you got to be durable, and you have to be able to grow with the game. Brian? Alley, he keeps getting better and better. Thanks for that. Good stuff. Making a change here. Makai Luke's checked in. Pass to Tatum. Back to Pritchard. Here's Tillman. It's deflected. Here's Ginobili. Here's Mills. And it's Jason Tatum with a rebound. Boy, in that close, he's almost automatic. Boy, that's pretty good defense. Wow. Pass to Makai Luke. Screen by Horford. Knocks it down from distance. Look, Luke's gotten himself going with a triple. His first basket of the game. 
Outside Mills. And there's the screen. The rebound, Celtics. And about three minutes played now in the second quarter. Here's Tatum. Not on target. Four for nine in this one. San Antonio trailing here. And here's Mills for three. Crops in the three. Well, this is a big part of Patty Mills' job, right? Knocking down three-point shots. Tatum with it. He's got nine. Here's Pritchard. Out to the right wing. Tillman passes to Pritchard. Another miss. He's 0 for 2 now. And almost four minutes gone in the second quarter of play. Here's Duncan. And from 16 feet away, he cans it. And it's a three-point Spurs lead. Duncan's gone 3 for 3 from the floor. Pass to Tatum. Back to Pritchard. Horford, a screen on Mills. Down to five on the shot clock. Horford can't hit. <laughs> and I'm surprised that didn't go down. I mean, I'm sure he is too. Here's Ginobili. Into the lane. With the second effort, a nice shot by Duncan. That'll drive your coach crazy, failing to box out. Ugh. And to me, this is a common theme that's running through the league right now. Guys looking to leak out rather than box out. JT to the hole. Right wing. They need this. Another score. His fifth make out of ten tries. Al Horford is such a tremendous passer as a big man. Wow, does he get work done offensively. They set the screen. Here's Ginobili. Hounded by Tatum. Joseph. From behind the arc. On target from range. Joseph has got seven points for the quarter. Well, this was another shot that Corey Joseph has developed. I'll tell you, get the catch-and-shoot game going. Look out. Horford outside. Outside Tatum. Ooh, rugged finish from Tatum. They're punishing those late defensive rotations, getting good looks inside throughout the half. San Antonio leading. Joseph passes to Ginobili. Outside Mills. Launches it from deep. The rebound by Jason Tatum. Tatum's got four rebounds now. Here's Pritchard. No points yet. It's Mikhailuk on the wing. And here's Horford for three. Rebounded by Joseph. On offense, here is San Antonio. Three-point lead. Out to the right wing. Here's Ginobili. And that one's good. Joseph. Joseph has got nine. Now, Corey Joseph does not lack for confidence on the interior. Don't let the size fool you. The frame, the game, it's all there. And Tatum's got the ball here for the Celtics. Hey, Tatum, getting it done inside. This guy reads situations so well, and he knows how to execute. That's the DL. Back to Mills. Wing shot on the way. Rebound Boston. Tatum's got five rebounds in the game. And here are the Celtics. Over to the left wing. Here's Pritchard. Here's Tillman. And it's Ginobili with a rebound. Out to the wing. All alone. 
And count it. Now five for seven. Boston trailing. Outside Tatum. Takes the three. And Tatum drills the three. Jason Tatum has built such consistency from beyond the arc. Doesn't matter if there's a contest or not. Timeout called the Spurs. Adjustments are a part of every game and every quarter of a game. I think Coach sees something here. Well, this is a chess match. Looking ahead a few moves and trying to execute toward that. Deciding to change it up. against Holiday. Outside, Green. Back to Parker. Clock at six. Over Holiday. That shot's good by Parker. Parker's got 20 points. Holiday against Parker. Here's White. White coming through. And Holiday takes this responsibility seriously. When someone is open on his squad, he gets it to them. And here is Green. Still no points. Parker outside. Over Holiday. And he can't bank that one in. Well, seized up just a little bit at the last second. That's one he normally converts. Pass to Porzingis. And a great assist by Brown as that one goes in. Porzingis has got his second basket on the night. Porzingis has gone two of four so far tonight. Holiday against Parker. Outside, Green. Blocking foul, Paul. Al Holford. Second personal foul. First team foul. Here's Diaw. Pass to Green. Here's Diaw. Six to shoot. Beyond the arc. Sinks the tray. Diaw's got five. He really hooked the defender with that pump fake. It worked to perfection. Porzingis with a screen on Leonard. Right side Brown. Tipped. Parker against Holiday. Pass to Green. Inside. Here's Splinter. Horford with the block. Well, this is how Al Horford gets it done as a rim protector. His anticipation and his positioning are exceptional. Holiday passes to Brown. Oh, 
Oh, look at Brown banging inside. The passing, the shooting, the scoring, it's all clicking right now for Jalen Brown. Holiday against Parker. That shot missing. Some solid defense from Holiday. Brown against Leonard from 10 feet away. And it's Boston scoring again. Yeah, Jalen Brown working in that mid-range area. This guy knows it's got to be a part of your game. Outside, Green. 103 left to play in the second quarter. Boston foul. Derek White. Second personal foul. Second team foul. At the line for your Spurs, Danny Green. Shooting two. He's off on the first. Hauser, he's checked in for Horford. And he's good on the second. And it's Holiday with the ball for the Boston Celtics. Pass to Hauser. Brown against Green. Brown inside. San Antonio with a rebound. 40 seconds left in the first half of this game. Holiday against Parker. Over Holiday. And count that. Two points and a chance for one more at the line. He hears the whistle and he keeps his concentration and is able to knock it down. At the line for your Spurs, Tony Parker. One shot. One shot. Twenty-nine seconds left in the first half. Green against Brown. From the right block. And that one hits the back iron. San Antonio leading. Might be a good idea to run the clock. Hold it for the last shot. It's all about patience right here. Patience and execution. Get a good look. There's a screen. Here's Parker. Nice shot from the wing. Parker's got seven now in this quarter. And a pretty tightly contested game here as we end the first half. Spurs out in front. They're up by five. And we'll step away briefly, but get you right back out there for the start of the third quarter, right after the break.
And as we get into this third quarter, as we've seen so far, neither team able to create much separation on the scoreboard. On the court right now for the Celtics. White and Brown with the two and the three. Kristaps Porzingis out there with Jason Tatum. And it's Holiday in at the one spot. And Porzingis with the block. Holiday surveying the floor. Pass to Tatum. Kept alive. Outside White. Three-pointer goes up. Three-pointer goes down for White. Yeah, Porzingis, because he's a scoring threat, that's going to open up opportunities for him to find his teammates. San Antonio with the ball. Two-point game. Here's Duncan. Now here's Leonard. Splitter. Pass to Parker. Uses the glass to finish the layup. Parker's got 27 points. If the defender has given him that much space, the points are inevitable. Second half, getting started. About a minute play. Holiday against Parker. Holiday passes to Brown. Knocks it loose. And stolen by Leonard. Pass to Parker. Here's Duncan. And out of bounds. Boston will have it. First minute and a half of basketball played here in the third quarter. Holiday is screen on Leonard. Brown with it. Parker picks him up. And the basket by Holiday. Well, Jalen Brown getting better and better in pick and roll situations. There's a real willingness to give up the basketball. And it's San Antonio's ball. The lead is two. Green, the pass to Parker. Here's Splitter, defended by Porzingis. White with the steal. Here's Tatum. <laughs> Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. The best offensive players in the league get to the free throw line consistently. This is where you're starting to see growth from Jason Tatum. Wanting the contact, inviting the contact. Take a break. Take a break. Two shots. First free throw is good. And it's tied up with that one. And now around two minutes gone by in this half. Now here's Parker. He's got 27. Green for three. Fires in the triple. You're going to have to guard him differently because Danny Green has got big time range. You've got to extend your defense. Now Brown. Get Brown getting it done inside. The defense couldn't collapse quickly enough. Second half of play here. We're just under two and a half minutes past. Outside, Green. Back to Parker. On the wing, Green. He's guarded by White. Five to shoot. Leonard outside from deep. And again, it's the Spurs from deep. This guy has such a nose for the basket. Kawhi Leonard not afraid to let it fly on the catch. And so Holiday will bring it up for the Celtics. Pass to Brown. 
Down low. They kick it out to Porzingis. Oh, through contact! White gets the finish. Since the break, it feels like an entirely new game. What energy we're seeing. Something has lit a fire under both of these teams. Outside, Green. Pass to Splitter. Here's Parker. Rebound, Boston. Porzingis has got four rebounds now. Brown finds Tatum. And Kawhi Leonard gets a whistle that time. That'll be a second foul of the game. Second team foul. Outside Tatum. Porzingis sets a screen. Clock at six. Fires at the elbow. Another one falls for Boston. Now this is one of the best scorers in the game today. Jason Tatum, we're getting used to performances like this. Parker against Holiday. Parker left side. Pass to Duncan. Oh, and there's the whistle on the shot. So two free throws for him coming up. That one on Tatum. Misses the free throw. And the second free throw is good. Yeah, he gets them the lead at the free throw line despite the one miss. Austin trailing. Outside, Brown. To the paint for the lead. What a finish from Porzingis. Well, this guy's got size and showing increasing strength. Kristaps Porzingis, nicely done. Parker right side. Pass to Green. Tatum against Parker. Over Tatum. That shot's good by Parker. Parker's got 29. Here in the second half, this game's still nip and tuck. <laughs> Just an insane amount of lead changes. The fans are getting their money's worth. Outside Porzingis. Play clock. The Celtics got a hurry here. And here's Brown for three. Rebounded by Green. Oh, that was a great effort defensively. Get a hand up in the face of the shooter. It's so important. Parker outside. Here's Duncan. Pounded by Tatum. A nice shot by Duncan. And now a three-point Spurs lead. When you use it right, the pump fakes as effective a move as there is. Duncan's gone five of seven from the floor here. Porzingis sets a screen. Tatum from long range. Splitter with a rebound. Splitter's got six rebounds here tonight. Parker against Holiday. Parker passes to Duncan. And he throws it down. What a terrific lead pass. Oh, not the defensive effort they need to cut into the lead. Boy, good call. You have to at least try to protect the rim. They're just too slow to react. You can't afford to sleepwalk through possessions. What's going on out there? Nails it from three. Holiday's got five. 
from year to year, Holiday is a little inconsistent from three, but the defense has to respect his shot. Marker outside. Pass to Green. Holiday against Parker. Uses the glass on the layup. Parker's got six here in the quarter. Well, Danny Green excels at recognizing when his teammates have open looks and putting it on the money. Nicely done. And it's Holiday with the ball for the Boston Celtics. On the wing, Tatum. Outside Holiday. White with it. It's Brown on the wing. There's Tatum with the three. And a great assist by Brown as that one goes in. Brown's got his fifth assist in this one. San Antonio leading. Parker outside. Outside, Green. Kicks it out to Parker. To the middle, Duncan. Back to Parker. And it goes out of bounds. Last touch by Parker. That's miscommunication, and we rarely see that happen. So it's both teams making substitutions here. Boston on offense. They trail by one. Brown finds Holiday. For the lead. San Antonio with a rebound. He couldn't believe how open he was. He just couldn't convert it. Parker with it. Give him 31 now. Splitter. Pass to Parker. Here's Duncan. Defended by Porzingis. And denied. He sends it right off the glass. Outside. Brown. Porzingis sets a screen. Brown downhill. The turnaround jumper. Got a hand on it. And he recovers it. Horford for three. Connects from downtown. Timeout, timeout. And the Celtics lead by two. Well, this is just another way that Al Horford can beat you. He has turned himself into a quality three point shooter. Time called here. The Spurs decide to talk it over. And the players take this opportunity to get some Gatorade. Getting some fluids in you is so important during these timeouts. Get fresh, keep those batteries charged. Yeah, without proper hydration, a player can completely run out of gas down the stretch of a ball game. And that's something that none of these guys can afford to have happen. If you're going to battle all the way to the finish, you have to be hydrated. Changes here for the Celtics. Tillman comes in for Kristaps Porzingis. And Pritchard is subbed in for Tatum. San Antonio trailing here. And here's Parker. He's got 31. Pass to Green from the arc. Rebound Boston. Horford's got his fourth rebound in this one. The Celtics on offense. Tillman with a screen. Holiday from long range. The rebound by Duncan. Duncan's got 11 rebounds in the game. Ginobili, pass to Parker. Inside. And it's Tillman with a rebound. 
on the wing, Holiday. He's got five. Horford outside. The three. And it's Ginobili with a rebound. San Antonio with the ball. Parker outside. Pass to Ginobili. Over Holiday. Ginobili gets the bucket. Ginobili's got his second bucket of the night. Ginobili's gotten two of his three shots to go tonight. Brown inside. And stolen by Green. The ball's knocked loose. Here's Pritchard. Parker defending. And here's Holiday. Three-pointer. And he goes up strong with a one-handed jam. I mean, Holiday is a master of the fundamentals, using the tried-and-true pick-and-roll to create for his guys. And they've been moving the ball really well tonight. Good things come to those who take good shots. Here's Parker. Good on the bucket. Parker's got eight points here in the quarter. That's what you call playing big. He just stays committed to the attack mode. Well, major height disadvantage. He recognizes that and still able to score it. Holiday finds Brown. Here's Tillman. And he goes in for the dunk. Boy, what a pass by Jalen Brown. Probably one of his most improved areas. They haven't held the lead for a while. And B.A., that's why this possession is so big for them. It could be the turning point in the game. Duncan. Oh, and they immediately answer back with a dunk on the other end. Oh, what ferocity on the throwdown. I just love when he goes up with purpose. Where was the D right there? The effort lacking big time. Yeah, and give him credit for taking advantage in a close game. Those are the types of plays that can swing things in your direction. Brown passes to Tillman. Holiday with the ball from outside the arc. Good. And Brown gets the assist. Holiday's got eight points. They are unconscious from outside. And so far, the defense has had no answer. Well, that's the whole point, isn't it? If you space the floor well enough, it's almost impossible for the defense to account for everyone. Time called here. San Antonio decides to talk it over. Both teams making some changes here. Fifty-six seconds left to play in the third quarter. That shot's good by Parker. Parker's got ten points in just the second half. Wow, he doesn't make those kind of plays too often. Sweet move inside. And so Holiday will bring it up for the Celtics. It's a one-point game. From downtown. 
San Antonio with a rebound. Yeah, and the defense has really got to tighten up on him. I mean, he's just too dangerous from the three-point line. You know, two things happen there. Excellent coverage on the shot, and then finish the possession securing the boards. Twenty seconds left in the third. Fires for three. Drills it from deep. Holiday's got 11 points. Holiday's gone three of six from beyond the arc. Parker left side. Boston foul. Sam Hauser. First personal foul. Second team foul. Substitution on the court. There's six seconds left in the third. Here's Ginobili. And the three off target. And that'll do it for the third quarter. Celtics out in front, up by four. And right after this, we'll bring you the start of the final quarter right here on 2K Sports. And a worthy candidate tonight as we take a look at our State Farm Assist of the Game. You talk about painting a magnificent picture with that dime. Just a great decision and a perfect delivery. We call that putting it right in the pocket. And he knew what to do with it once it was there. And it's been a very competitive game so far as we get rolling here in quarter number four. The Celtics with the lead. We've got Patrick Mills, and it's Duncan in at the pivot spot, manning the middle. That's who's in the game for the Spurs. And the basket by Holiday. Yeah, the evolution of Tatum as a passer is evident. This guy more committed than ever to making the right play. That's the deal. Back to Mills. Four on the clock. Bullseye! Yeah, Patty Mills has run this set countless times. So composed, so intelligent at exploiting the defense. They set the pick. Tatum way outside. The rebound by Diaw. San Antonio with the ball. Trailing by five. Now here's Mills. Not a lot of room. The three. The rebound, Celtics. Horford's got his fifth rebound in this one. Tatum against Williams. Tatum knocks it down. He's locked in right now. Well, Jason Tatum has worked hard to fill out his frame. It's not going to bother him that you're bringing a level of physicality. We've gone about a minute and a half into this fourth quarter. Mills, the pass to Ginobili, to the inside. Cash, Mills with the bucket. And despite the size mismatch, getting a little aggressive down there in the paint. Some guys just relish the challenge. Find a way, and he does. Here's Tatum, outside Holiday. Tillman with a screen. Down low. Cuts off the pass. Now the Spurs moving it up the floor. And there's a whistle. He'll head to the line to shoot two. That one on Tatum. Let's get a quick check of the scoring breakdown here for Boston. Well, they have owned the offensive perimeter throughout this game, finding lots of openings and turning them into big shots. Also, they've been living in the lane. They're getting the ball in close, and it's had a devastating impact all game long. The free throw drops for Williams. Cornette's checked in for Boston. Hauser comes in for Holiday.
And Williams drops them both. Here are the Celtics with the ball. Three-point lead. Horford, a screen on Williams. Oh, count it! Tatum hits from way out! Well, Jason Tatum always working to expand his range. He might as well be in the next county. Pass to Mills. They set a pick. Launches the three. And the three-pointer goes. <laughs> That's how you up the ante. Come right back at him. And you would expect nothing less from these two, taking pride and making plays. Left side, Tatum. Five on the clock. Pass to Hauser. Here's Cornett. Beyond the arc. The shot, no good. Back to Mills. Around three minutes gone here in the fourth. Ginobili, no good. That's not his spot, but given the lack of defense, you'd like to see him knock that one down. Pass to Cornett. Outside Tatum. The three is up. Rebounded by the Spurs. Duncan's got rebound number 12 now. Tenacity on the glass. Ginobili, pass to Diaw. Here's Ginobili. Left side, Mills. To tie it up. Rebound, Boston. Right side, Tatum. Here's the three. The rebound by Duncan. Duncan's got rebound number 13 tonight with that one. Here's Williams. Tatum pulls it in. Tatum's got six rebounds now in the game. Pass to Horford. Here's Pritchard. On the wing, Tatum. Williams defending. Here's Horford. A rebound by Diaw. And the defense gets bailed out by the miss. He usually converts that. Here's Ginobili. And the foul is called. He missed it. So he's got a couple of free throws coming his way. Second team foul. And he makes a first. Green's checked in for San Antonio. The Celtics also with a sub. Holiday's checked in for Cornett. And good on the second, so he makes them both. Two-part equation. You have to be aggressive enough to get to the line, then talented enough to time sink out, them.
to hear from Allie LaForce. During that last break, I heard Joe Mazzula as he talked with the team. Coach was blunt with his assessment. He said to throw out everything that happened until now. It is a brand new game, and it's only a few minutes. Leave it out on the floor. Back to you guys. And Allie, thanks. Pritchard, the pass to Holiday. To end the drought. Oh, nice fake, but the layup's off the mark. San Antonio trailing here. Ginobili, the pass to Diaz. And he was fouled while in the act of shooting, so he'll take two free throws. Personal foul. Man, good whistle there. At the line for your Spurs, Boris Diaz. Two shots. No good on the free throw. That one drops. He ties it up. Boy, the missed free throw there, keeping this game at even. We'll see if that comes back to haunt them. Now here's Holiday. Three-pointer. The rebound by Diaw. Diaw's got five rebounds tonight. To the middle. Here's Duncan. Oh, and a beautiful feed leads to a monster jam. And you can feel the temperature rising in this arena. Both teams pouring it on offensively. There's been a bit of a flurry here late, and this game may come down to which side gets a stop or two. Now Holiday to halt the run. Here's Horford. San Antonio with a rebound. Ginobili's got his fourth rebound in this one. Here's Green. And Pritchard pulls it down. Green's gotten just one of his four attempts from the floor tonight. Here's Pritchard. Pass to Tatum. Takes a three. On target from range. Tatum's got eight points here in the quarter. Just tremendous confidence from Jason Tatum. This guy understands I am a scorer even at the most elite level. Here's Mills. It's on target from the high post. Coming down the stretch, it's still anyone's game. Incredible effort and energy on both sides. These guys must be gassed. Pritchard, the pass to Tatum. Here's Pritchard. He's guarded by Mills. Pass to Tatum. Shot clock at six. Carries it down low. Tatum's got 36 points. Well, you see the effectiveness of Jason Tatum in close. Don't sleep on both his strength and his length. Horford with a steal. Pritchard, the pass to Horford. Outside Holiday. Shot clock at five. Fires the three. And it's Ginobili with a rebound. Ginobili's got five rebounds tonight. To the paint. Here's Diaw. Nice assist and nice finish. Solid play all the way around. And you want him taking good shots at this point in the game. And that one was easy. Boy, when it's this close, you try not to give up these kinds of buckets. Boy, you got to do better defensively. Outside Tatum. Chalk up two there. Tatum's got 38 points. 
And that was the right decision. When you're in need of a bucket, time out, time so out. go to your most trusted guys. Well, you've got to Hard. earn trust and equity by making shots. Nice delivery there. Time called here. San Antonio decides to talk it over. Changes here for the Celtics. Porzingis has checked in for Horford. Brown comes in for Hauser. And it's White in for Pritchard. Inside. Leonard for three. Look at Leonard. Dialed in from deep. Now Kawhi Leonard consistently efficient with his scoring ability. Nice jumper. Boston trailing. Outside Tatum. Outside White. Back to Holiday. Down low. And there's White. That's good on the assist from Holiday. Putting his court vision on full display. Holiday plays the role of floor general pretty effectively. Holiday against Parker. Outside. Green. And out of bounds. The Celtics will take it. And it's time to take another look at that powerful block. And this is exactly why he's out here, in order to block shots in tight games like this. And so it's Porzingis with it. He brings it up for the Boston Celtics. Outside, Brown. Pass to Tatum. From downtown. And Parker pulls it down. <laughs> Just terrible defense. I don't know how he missed that shot. Porzingis. Seven foot six wingspan sending it back. Kristaps Porzingis with the rejection. Outside Holiday. And here's Tatum. Fires from deep. And Drew Holiday gets a three. Holiday's got 17 now, just in the second half. San Antonio trailing here. And here's Parker. Outside, Green. Back to Parker. Pass to Duncan. Leonard for three. Offensive rebound. Boom! He jams it straight down. <laughs> and when the game is this close, you have to go all out. He certainly understands his role, huh? When the shot goes up, just crashes the offensive glass. And that's so demoralizing to your opponent. To play great defense and have the possession end that way, that's tough to take. Brown with it, and it's Leonard picking him up. On the wing, Tatum. Outside White, to the paint. Oh, Porzingis getting it done inside. Well, one thing we know, Porzingis is fearless. He had no hesitation on what was a huge basket for them. Parker against Holiday. Two minutes remaining in the game. Two minutes. Parker outside. The shot's good. 
Parker's got 37. Defensively, you can't afford to get stuck on the pick. You know exactly what that takes. It takes energy, it takes activity, it takes intensity. Outside Tatum. Outside Porzingis. That three's off the mark. Defense dodged a bullet that time. Total breakdown. That shot's good by Parker. Parker's got 39. Oh, this one has turned into an absolute nail-biter. Yeah, at this point, you almost expect it to come down to the last possession. A minute 29 left in the fourth quarter. Tatum drives in. Pass to White. Outside Holiday. Puts up a three. Nails it from three. Give him 20. And the leadership of Holiday shining through. Wow. Awesome to see him come up big like this. To the middle. And he dunks it. What a pass to set him up. three left in the fourth quarter. Now here's Tatum. Pass to Porzingis. From outside the arc. San Antonio with a rebound. He didn't make them pay for that weak defense, but they just can't rely on him to miss those kind of shots. Parker finds Green. Oh, he buried the three! Big time shot, sending his teammates into a frenzy. I'll tell you, these guys have worked so hard together. Everyone pulling in the same direction. Beautiful to watch. Here's Brown. Splitter with a rebound. This is what it's come down to. Yes, indeed. A monster possession. We've got a nine-second difference between the shot clock and game clock. Parker, not going to go that time. And Boston calls time here. They're down by three. 20 seconds left to play in the fourth. All right, guys, what's your take? Tricky situation here. They need some kind of bucket to stay alive. And it's either got to be a three-pointer or a score quickly and take the foul. Porzingis has got the ball here for the Celtics. Oh, wow! A, a huge basket to tie the game! He wants the ball, has a flair for the dramatic, unfazed in big situations. Time called here. San Antonio decides to talk it over. Parker. Tight defense on him. For the win! Oh! Couldn't sink it and we're going to overtime! Time expires! We're going to overtime! And we've got more NBA action on 2K Sports coming your way after the break.
you with us as we get going in overtime. Neither team giving an inch in this game. Wide in Brown with the two and the three. Jason Tatum out there with Kristaps Porzingis. And it's Holiday in at the point. Back to Parker. And Porzingis with the block. And as it goes out of bounds, San Antonio will keep possession. Here's Parker. It's stolen by Holiday. Shoots over Parker. And the basket by Holiday. Holiday's got 22 points. <laughs> they have a never give up attitude. No doubt keeping it very close. They're going to have to step up even more to get over the hump here. And that one's good. Green. Uh, Danny Green is one of the best catch and shoot players in the league. Makes it look easy. Boston trailing. Outside Tatum. Pass to Porzingis. That falls. Nice feed that time from Tatum. You have to have the vision to find the open man. Beautiful pass. Extra time here. Just over a minute into overtime. On the wing, Green. He's guarded by White. Now here's Parker. Six on the shot clock. Duncan, pass to Splitter. Over Porzingis. Splitter can't hit. Splitter's gone just one for four so far. Parker against Holiday. Tatum way outside. And again, Boston with the triple. Oh, nice looking shot. I mean, especially from that deep. Now Parker. Outside, green. Pass to Duncan. Parker outside. Here's Green. Let's it go from deep. He buries it from three. Now Danny Green has got such big time experience. He is undeterred in a big moment. Here's Tatum. Holiday with the ball. Parker defending. And here's Brown for three. And again, Boston with the triple. Oh, Jalen Brown with the big shot, proving hard work pays off. Parker against Holiday. Fires from the line. Parker, no good. The Celtics with the lead. Brown passes to Tatum. Back to Brown. Leonard against Tatum. Tim Duncan. Second personal foul. First team foul. San Antonio on D. Porzingis up top. Pulls out oh. high post. And it goes as the official calls the foul. Count it, and he'll shoot one more at the line. There's one big man who exemplifies the evolution of size in the NBA. It's KP. Kristaps Porzingis can stretch the floor. He can get out and run in transition. It's a combination you almost have to have. It's Parker on the attack. Count it. Parker's got 41. Here's Tatum.
Porzingis sets a screen. Tatum finds Brown. Shot clock at six. For three. And again, Boston with the triple. Well, beautiful stroke from Jalen Brown. Crucial moving forward that he shoot it well from the perimeter. Parker against Holiday. Puts the move on. Parker, no good. Boston on offense. They lead by eight. Biggest lead of the game. And too long on the shot. And so it's Green who brings up the ball for San Antonio. Pass to Parker. To the inside. Ooh, and he took a hard foul on the shot. So he'll head to the line to shoot a pair. That one on Tatum. At the line for two. He hits the first one, and that narrows the gap to seven. And so he makes both from the line. And those were big shots. At this point in the game, we can't afford to leave any points at the line. Outside Tatum. Yep, that one goes. Tatum's got 46. Looking to close things out, that might have been the nail in the coffin. Well, at this point, they're so far up, it would take a real collapse to give this game away at this point. Here's Parker. Pass to Splitter. Back to Parker. And Porzingis with the block. And here's Tatum to the paint. And it's Porzingis that time on the assist from Tatum. And it's a 10-point Boston lead. Stepping up and nailing an important shot to put this away. Yeah, playing with great energy and great effort. And as a coach, you'd love to see this from your team every single night. Here's Splitter. 4-3. And gets it to fall. You know, a guy with that size from the downtown three-point area. No chance for a defender to alter that shot. So we see the Celtics get the win here. They escape with the W, even though they needed a few extra minutes to pull it off. And both teams gave their all. But when it came down to overtime, it was about who had more determination. And that's going to do it tonight, folks, for our broadcast. For Allie LaForce, Doris Burke, and Grant Hill, this is Brian Anderson alongside our 2K Sports crew thanking you for watching. Now it's time to present our New Balance Player of the Game, Jason Tatum.